hello everyone welcome to tips and tricks tutorial and today i'm going to present expand and collapse so while we have the long content we used to give the like read more and the read less so read more just for the expanding the text or the card and read less to just hide it or the collapse so i have an example So here in this card we have this content and while I click on the read more it is getting expanded the card as well as the text we can see here. So now we can collapse. So it is very easy to create in Figma using the variables and conditions. So here I am going to create it. So we need a frame and the same way we we take the rectangle and make the card so we need to give the radius and then we need to give the color now we need a text so we'll take the text So here the text is UX, so we'll take the same content here, so just copy this content. And uh, now we need a read more, so for read more I have taken the polygon and the uh, text, so I will copy this. And I placed here. So now we need a next text. So for that, I will select this and just copy this and have it here. Now read list. So same way, we'll just copy this and paste it. So here, read list is here and here. So just make it visible and after visible we can use this read list here. Now I need to create the local variable so for that we come to the local variable. So here we will create the local variable which is boolean and we can say text and text will be false which will be the like of this okay so we can say here ui and just need some random text here for the example so just make it this little bigger so it can be understandable yeah now we need two more boolean for one for the read more so read more will be visible and then next is read less so read less will be false so that's it three local variable is required so now i'm going to give the interaction here so here it is already given so i will hide this and use this come to interaction on click and we can write here the condition in on click if read more if read more equal to true then add action read more make it false so first condition is done and here we can set the else part 
so read more will be false okay it is in else part so we can say here true so technique is to look at this first statement from where it started and we made it false and again we can say in else part true now we can see the another condition while read more is false so what will happen so here this text we need to give the name text 2 I have given here and uh, this is text 1 and then this is the read more so read more is below text 2 and the read less is below the text 1 okay so we'll arrange accordingly yeah so now text 2 read less and uh, text 1 read more so we are writing for the read more so now here if the condition will be like uh, read more equal to false so what will happen if we have assigned this read more equal to false means the text 2 will be visible right so here we can say set variable this text so this text will be true if read more is false and then here uh, we can add one more condition for the read list so the same condition we can add here like a read more equal to false so we can say the read list to true so this is for the read more now we are going to write for the read list so we will remove this add interaction and here we will select the condition so if read list equal to true so what will happen set variable read list to false so while I click on the read list it will be disappear and as well as this content the text will be disappear so here now this text need to be disappear and uh, for that we'll need to write again so here if it is true we can make it read less to false so in true and else part so now in condition if the read less if read less equal to false means this is not appearing then this text won't be appear so here we can say this text should be false done now this part is done now the just a part of this because we are getting hided this so we can say here set condition if read less equal to true so false is done and uh, so here we can say false so if read less is false set variable read more true that's it now need to pass through the so this come to design and here pass through this 
text one. So here is the text. So text. So before getting hided or passing through this, we have to capture this all and make it as auto align. So auto layout. While we are creating the auto layout, we need to select all. So like here rectangle read place text to then read more and this make it auto layout now you can see here while i select this and pass through this with the text it is getting hided and read less is hided here and we need to pass read less also now this is for the read more so read more detach and again pass through and this is not required to manage it. so now we can preview this so read more and here it is coming read less and read more so this is the very a small trick but it is working fine and it is very useful while we are creating the prototype or wireframe so how is the trick please let me know thank you thank you very much